So let's continue. If we go for valency, combining capacity of element is simply called as valency. Valency can be calculated by V for valency for elements from for elements from 1a to 4a group for elements for 1a from for elements of 1a group to 4a group valency is calculated by valency is equal to group number Valence is equal to group number. Example, you can take, if you take sodium, it belongs to 1A group. This sodium, its valency is equal to 1. 1A group. If you go for magnesium, you go for aluminium, it belongs to 3rd A group. Its valency is equal to 3. Group number is equal to valency. But for elements, for elements, for elements from 5th A to 8th A, A group, 8th A group, valency is equal to group number minus 8. Take one example if you take example you take phosphorus which belongs to 50 its valency can be calculated by valency v is calculated by belongs to 50 so 5 minus 8 which is equal to minus 3 so therefore ignoring the sign ignoring the negative sign you can simply say that the valency of phosphorus is 3 you go for sulfur belongs to 60 group so its valency V is equal to group number minus 8. So 6 minus 8 which is equal to minus 2. So what is its valency means 2. Okay, overall valency is minus 2. Simply valency is 2. So like this you can calculate the valency for the various group elements using the formula valency is equal to group number and valency is equal to group number minus 8. So these are the two concepts which you have to keep it in your mind. Then after that if you go for Second one, that is, this is the first case, number one, valency number two. Atomic size. So, if you go for atomic size, atomic size, if you take period, group reason atomic size in a group decreases and in a group it increases in a group it will increase a in a period atomic size decreases because in period in period if you take nuclear charge the nuclear charge the nuclear charge increases nuclear charge increases nuclear force of attraction attraction increases between nucleus and nucleus and valency electrons nucleus and valency electrons so this is something about the 
I mean decrease of the atomic size in a period this is the justification if you go for a group in group that is B in group you find that nuclear charge of course here also nuclear charge NC stands for nuclear charge increases nuclear force of attraction nuclear force of attraction NFA nuclear force of attraction NFA nuclear force of attraction uh, it uh, nuclear force of attraction decreases between nuclear force of attraction decreases between nucleus nucleus and valency electrons nuclear force of attraction decreases between nucleus and the nuclear force of attraction decreases between nucleus and the valency electrons is the reason why we have to understand that the atomic radius decreases in a period and the atomic radius increases in a period atomic size or atomic radius both mean one and the same here atomic atomic size or you can say radius atomic size and atomic radius atomic size and this is atomic radius and atomic size if you like this video please give a thumbs up Please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on CBSE syllabus.